If you're taking prescribed medications, follow up with your GP or pharmacist if you're thinking about taking herbal remedies too. Generally, they are safe, but there are some cases where it can cause an interaction. For example, St John's wort can speed up the breakdown of a medication, decreasing the levels of the drug in the body, making it less effective. Pain is an individual thing, and herbal remedies can be used as an alternative treatment option. But have a chat with your pharmacist to make sure that there's no herb-drug interactions. But at the end of the day, if it works for you and it's safe, you get the green light from us. I take an iron supplement and in the colder months, a vitamin D supplement, as recommended by my GP, based on the low levels in my body. I do get regular blood tests to make sure that I'm taking the right dose and increase or decrease the dose as required. There are other supplements that I take when I need them. If I'm feeling run down or tired, a vitamin B supplement, particularly vitamin B12, really help boost my energy levels or a general multivitamin for overall health. It really depends on the vitamin. There are water-soluble vitamins like vitamin B that can work almost immediately. And then there are fat-soluble vitamins like vitamin D, which can take a while for it to build up in the body. There are also so many variables to consider. Your current or baseline vitamin levels, your diet, any underlying health issues, and what form you're taking it in, tablet versus liquid. Generally speaking, it can take one to three months to correct a vitamin deficiency.